Hey guys, Shrimp Midget here. I'm going to be making a video on my K, or not mine, Josh's KWA Mark II 1911. This was James's, um, but they traded, so now it's Josh's. Um, so this is the Mark II version. Um, let's just go over the magazine first. The magazine's drop free. It's got a plastic feed lip, plastic base plate, holds 20 rounds, um, which is more than most single stack style 1911s um it is double stacked bbs though but it's a single stacked size mag according to the real one um this one holds just a few rounds less than my kwa usp compact mag so it actually holds a good bit for the size of the mag um I recommend using 0.25 gram BBs, that's what I'm using in here, um, and propane. Um, if it's below 40 degrees, please use map gas. Uh, it's 35 outside, and I do not have map gas, so yeah, I will shoot this um, later on in the video, and I may even chrono it. So, um, plastic pistol grip, um, very unique texture, uh, metal frame with a rail three slot rail metal slide with kwa trademarks mark ii trademarks professional training pistol kwa um cal six millimeter i don't like the trades not really very good white dot sights three dots skeleton trigger skeleton hammer the hammer and trigger are steel uh functioning beaver tail safety won't fire unless you push in on it um, Ambi frame safety. Take it off. Plastic barrel, outer barrel, KWA does that. I'm not really a fan of that. Um, it's very smooth on the cycle. Very, very smooth. Take it apart, take the slide lock out, take the slide off. Got a few steel parts in here. Plastic nozzle, hop-up is adjustable via tool, which I do not have. Um, the tool for the hop-up, it goes in the barrel in the chamber. Um, again, propane and .25 BBs. I'll go ahead and shoot like two or three mags through this pistol. It's got it's loaded up with propane right now. It'll start to get cold, but this thing has been sitting in my house for about two hours. I haven't shot it for two hours, so it's cold or warmed up, um, and it's ready to be fired. The first magazine will shoot really nicely. Um, use point two fives or point two eights, maybe point threes. Uh, I'm not gonna chrono it, but feet per second, I'll actually shoot one shot um, through it because I just it's gonna cool down. 311 see the first shot is 311 feet per second with two fives when it's warm inside it's about 65 70 in here so expect that feet per second in the summer um so let's go and shoot it outdoors or outside out the window um recoil is minimal but uh cycles super smooth when it's warm Okay, it's out of ammo. Now, that shot really, really well. With the .25s, the BBs actually shot very, very straight. They hopped perfectly. Um, the wind is not, there's not a whole lot of wind out. There's a little bit. Um, but when it starts to cool down and the gas starts to run out and the, sli the cycle, cycle starts to be weak, the hop-up becomes horrible but again if you use mac gas it'll cycle better in the colder weather um if you live in a place that is warm you know 80 percent or if it's above 40 degrees most of the time you should be fine because you can use this in 50 degree weather with propane totally fine um or indoors indoors too um if you use this indoors you should have no problem with propane don't recommend green gas because green gas uh, has lubricant on it, in it, and it will get on your bucking and cause it to swell. Because KDBA buckings swell when you get lubricant on them, which is stupid, but 
That's just their design, I guess. Um, what was I about to say? Put a little bit more gas in here. About to say something, and I totally forget. So let's go ahead and shoot a second mag through it. Pretty loud pistol, too. I'm not a lefty. Range, um, pretty dang good. I'd say max range is about 140 feet um, when you're hop up, when your gun is cycling properly. You know, in the summer, you're going to be getting, like right now, those BBs are hopping really nicely. But when it starts to cool down, it begins to be crap. Yeah, that's really good. One BB left, it started to struggle. Let's go ahead and finish off the few BBs I have in the speed loader real quick. So, again, feet per second when it's warm out, when it's about 60, 70 degrees, it'll be an average of about 305 ish. Uh, the first shot was 311. So. we go so that's all the ammo 0.25 gram bb shot really well you could use two eights too even threes but two fives is a pretty good weight um cannot power stroke this one i think they changed that with their newer ones um so if you have any questions comment below thank you so much for watching um if you have any questions uh go ahead and feel free to ask I do recommend the pistol don't like kdba's buckings and their trademarks and the finish on the whole slide and frame is kind of a glossy more of a glossy it's not that good um i've seen much better so thank you guys for watching